Thanks for clicking and welcome to this beginner lesson on Simple Present WH Questions. In this lesson, I will teach you the formula for making questions in the Simple Present Tense. Okay, now these are not be verb questions. Okay, these are questions with verbs like want, need, have, live, eat, any verb except the be verb. Okay, um, now here we have one, two, three, four, five, six different questions with the six different question words, common question words in English here. Okay, so we have who for a person, what for more information, where for location, when for time, why for reason, how for an explanation. So here we have who do you look like? Okay, you notice the structure here. What is similar about all of these? Not just the first one, but what is similar about all of these questions? They all have the same structure. Okay, you have your question word, who, what, where, when, why, how. You have the do verb, do or does. You have the subject, you, she, he, you, they, I. And you have the base verb, look, want, come from, wake up, have, drive. The, stru the structure is exactly the same. Okay, so here, who do you look like? is not who are you look like, okay? Because if the answer is, for example, I look like, oh, I'm sorry about that, guys. I look like my mother. You don't say I am look. Okay, you never follow the be verb with another verb unless it's passive, but that's more, more advanced. Okay, so if the answer is, I look like my mother, the question is not, who are you look like? There is no be verb here, so there is no be verb in the question. You need the auxiliary do, and what you need is this structure. Okay, so wh question plus do or does plus subject, plus base verb. Okay, what does she want? Okay, let's ask this question and give an answer. She wants... Now, imagine that you are at McDonald's, okay, or any fast food restaurant, and you want dessert. Uh, what is a popular dessert at McDonald's? Maybe it depends on which country you're in, but here, um, usually like a, a, an ice cream cone or a McFlurry or something. I don't know if we can advertise freely, but there is some free advertisement for McDonald's. So she wants, okay, she wants a McFlurry, for example. And now again, the verb is wants, not she is wants. We do not say she is want, so we do not say what is she want. We also do not say what does want she. Now I know in some languages you put the verb before the subject when you make the question. Okay, in English you put the verb after the subject at the end of the question. Okay, this one, where does he come from? Uh, imagine you have a friend and someone asks you about your friend and they say, where does he come from? And you say, well, he comes from he comes from, for example, Mexico. And I just noticed we have Mother McFlurry, Mexico. Lots of M's. Okay. When do you wake up? I wake up at 6.30 a.m. Again, you notice the structure, right? When you're giving simple present sentences, I look like, she wants, he comes from, I wake up. Um, there's no be verb, so in the question, 
you need the do auxiliary after the question word. Why do they have three cars? Maybe they have a lot of money. Okay, how do I drive to Priscilla? Take the highway, okay. You take you take the highway. Okay, excellent. Okay, guys, so please, please be careful with the do verb and the be verb when making simple present questions. Again, if there is no be verb in the response, there is no be verb in the question. Okay, remember, this is really important, do and does.